I wish to have that voice, the one I am forever denied, the one that knows things now that forever will escape the ears of those to whom they should be said. Those souls who have moved on from this world have taken the voice with them. Consider the meaning of this. A voice speaking to no one, or to whom it has no meaning, is not a voice. It is not even a sound, really, because it is not heard. Not by the one you long to have heard it. And so we deny ourselves this voice. We do not have to, but we do. Sometimes out of fear, other times out of ignorance, or even laziness. It is a bit like maturity. We deny that to others, when we do not have it ourselves. I do not yet know how to learn this lesson. What other voices will I find, when they no longer exist? The past calls to me, the future calls to me, but I can only live in the present. Perhaps there is this. I will listen to the voice myself. I will tell myself things. I will take some time before I respond. This is not something I owe myself. It is something I owe those who were denied the voice. For not only did I deny them my voice, I denied them theirs.